For more information related to the civil engineering concepts and civil engineering updates, please visit my website civilbasics123.com. Go to type civilbasics123.com in Google so that my website will be open here like this. So which is consisting of all detailed concepts related to the civil engineering topics. So please follow my website civilbasics123.com. In this video lecture, I will explain you uh, how to draw the house plan step by step procedure by using AutoCAD software. So for that, initially we need to draw the rough diagram in the paper format. Okay. So initially I will show you that uh, rough diagram as per the requirement of the client. Okay. So click on this image. This is my rough diagram, which I was already drawn as per the requirement of my client. Okay. So it will be consisting of approximately 65 feet in east facing direction and 63 feet in west facing direction, 60 feet in south facing direction and 60 feet approximately in north facing direction. Okay. So this is the requirement of the building plan as per his requirement. Okay. So it will be consisting of the staircases here and this is the dining. This is the open kitchen. This is the living and this is the bedroom. This is the washroom. This is the be uh, bedroom section. Okay. It will be consisting of six feet balcony and this is the six feet balcony and the gate is provided towards the south facing direction. In this video, I will explain you how to draw this particular floor plan by using AutoCAD software. Okay. So here I am having the AutoCAD 2015 version software. So if you follow this step by step procedure, you can able to draw the house plan uh, of any kind of the structure. Okay. So initially the software will be open here like this. So click on the start drawing option. Before drawing any kind of the plan, initially we need to set the units option. Okay. So for that, just I am selecting the units UN option, enter option. Okay. So here we have to select the uh, engineering purpose and which is comes under the feet section only. Click on OK. So after setting the units, we need to set the dimensions D, enter option, dimension style. Click on the modify option. Select the primary units option and select as per the engineering purpose and select the text as per the uh, text height. Okay, so here I am taking 9 inches text height approximately. Click on close option. So before drawing to the any kind of the house plan, initially we need to follow some of the steps. Okay, in that first one is related to the drawing the uh, site dimensions. Okay, this is the first step. Then after that, second step is to drawing the offsets and third step is to draw the walls and fourth step is to draw the uh, doors and windows and last step is to draw the dimensions. Okay. So these are the steps we need to follow five steps. We need to follow for drawing any kind of the floor plan. So first step is to draw the uh, site dimensions. So as per the requirement, it will be consisting of approximately 60 feet in south facing direction. So here I'm assuming this is the south facing. This is the east. This is the north and this is the west direction. So it will be consisting of approximately 60 feet here. So here I'm selecting this point. So turn on the R though by using F8 option. So here I'm drawing 60 feet 0 inches option. Okay. Now you can see here the line is drawn with the uh, considerations of the vertical section in the south facing direction. You can move the line by selecting move command M enter option. Select the base point here and click on this particular location. Again, you can move that particular point to the high direction here. Okay. So now we can see this is a 60 feet line. You can measure the dimensions here by using the measurement option. Select the starting point, second point. Now you can see it will be consisting of approximately 60 feet here. Okay. So again, in the same process, we have to draw the uh, another 60 feet uh, line at the south facing, uh, sorry, uh, north facing direction. Before that, we have to proceed with this 65 feet line. Okay. So here I'm selecting the line option here, L enter option, select the starting point. So here I'm drawing 65 feet, zero inches for the vertical section. Okay. So now we have to draw the uh, west facing direction, which is comes under this 63 feet. And this is the 60 feet option. Okay. So for that, firstly, we have to draw the circles with the help of the base of this uh, center point. Okay. So click on the circle command C enter option, select this particular uh, north facing direction. So it will be consisting of approximately 60 feet 0 inches here like this. Okay. Now we can see it was drawn with 60 feet 0 inches. Again, we have to draw the 63 feet in west facing direction. So for that, select the circle command C enter option. Select this location and you can draw her as 63 feet 0 inches here. Now you can see it was intersect the lines at this particular location. So click on the line command L enter option. Select the starting point here and join to this respected position and points here like this. Now you can see it was done with drawing of the side dimensions. You can measure the dimensions directly by using aligned option so that it will be consisting of approximately uh, sorry state here. So here I am selecting aligned option. Select the starting point. Again, we have to select the second point, which is consisting of approximately 60 feet here. Again, we have to measure the uh, dimensions of the last section. So here I'm selecting this uh, uh, linear option, select the starting point, 
again i am selecting the second point which is comes under 62 feet but you have to measure the dimensions as per the aligned section only why because it is not straight okay so here it is comes under the 63 feet so after drawing this particular areas we need to uh, draw the setback for the building structure it will be consisting of approximately 15 feet setback at this por portion here again it will be consisting of approximately they will consider 3 feet setback here okay again for compound wall 1 feet setback which is approximately of 14 4 feet okay so firstly i will draw the offset o enter which is consisting of 15 feet 0 inches uh, setback for this particular area again in the same process i am drawing the offset which is consisting of approximately 4 feet 0 inches setback for the height direction okay tr double enter option trim the excess of the portion at this re respected location <coughs> okay now we have to draw the wall section for the particular building okay so here now we can see it is consisting of approximately 32 feet 4 inches in this west facing direction at approximately it will be consisting of 32 feet in this direction so firstly we have to draw the offset o enter 32 feet 0 inches at this particular location sorry offset o enter 32 feet uh, 4 inches approximately so here i am drawing the offset here like this again in the same process offset command 32 feet 0 inches here for the vertical position so here i am selecting this area so trim the excess of the portion here just i am removing this particular area for this uh, section okay so now we can see this is the building plan area for the particular portion now we have to draw the external walls for this uh, uh, position so for the just i am selecting offset command which is comes under approximately 230 mm which is of 9 inches section so click on enter option select this area again i am selecting this area selecting this area again i am selecting this area now in the same process we have to draw the remaining offsets which is comes under the internal wall sections of the rooms okay it will be consisting of 15 feet here and 13 feet uh, approximately 13 feet uh, here in this position okay so here i am drawing this uh, uh, section here 13 feet initially so offset o enter 13 feet 0 inches here okay now you can see here it is drawn with 13 feet 0 inches section so again we have to draw the offset which is of internal wall of 5 inches section this time drawing here like this again in the same process we have to draw the one more wall section which is comes under the 12 feet section so click on offset command 12 feet 0 inches section so here i am drawing this particular area here offset command which is comes under the 5 inches section like this okay so again we have to draw the vertical section which is comes under the 15 feet here okay so click on the offset command o enter 15 feet 0 inches section now you can see here it was done with 15 feet 0 inches again we have to draw the internal wall section which is comes under the 15 feet only 5 feet only okay so now we have to trim the excess of the portion which is comes under this building plan now here you can see i was removed all the excess of the lines now we have to start with the uh, open kitchen here so which is consisting of 8 feet cross uh, 7 feet here so here i am drawing the offset o enter which is comes under 8 feet 0 inches section let us consider here like this again we have to draw the uh, puja room here so for that just i am drawing the line here like this tr double enter command mm. so click on this portion click on this portion again i am drawing the offset which is comes under 7 feet 0 inches section so here i am drawing here like this so trim the excess of the portion here tr double enter again we have to trim this excess of the portion now we have to draw the uh, internal wall for this uh, position let us consider here again i am considering here again i am considering here okay now we have to trim the excess of the portion for this plan also so now we can see all the external lines are removed for this uh, respected uh, objects here like this okay so now we have to add the doors and window section this is the next process of uh, third step okay so basically the doors and window sections are considered as per the dimensions which is provided uh, in the sec typical floor plan okay now we can see this is the uh, section and this is the plan okay so now we can see here we have to add the doors and window section it will be consisting of 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 doors here okay so now i will explain how to draw the doors okay so for drawing the door just i am giving the opening for the uh, floor plan like simple uh, method okay so don't add any kind of the blocks for this particular section just draw the two vertical lines trim this tr double enter option just trim the excess of the lines here in the same process we have to draw the doors for the remaining portion also so this is a simple process of uh, applying the doors now i will explain you how to draw the windows for this respected section okay 
so for drawing the windows initially we need to draw the line which is comes under the 9 inches section approximately okay again in the same process i am drawing one more line section which is also comes under the 9 inches section at this area so for that initially i am selecting this again i am selecting 9 inches section again i am closing this option okay so now i am selecting another line in order to make the uh, three panel for this particular portion just i am making the line here so select the trim option trim the top section and bottom section just we have to apply the offset which is comes under the three inches at the top section and bottom section okay select the top section click on delete option select the bottom section click on delete option trim these two lines at the top again trim these two lines at the bottom okay this is the process of creating the window now i will explain you how to draw the uh, create the window for the two panel section just i am drawing here just i am nine inches approximately again in the same process just i am considering here again i am selecting here nine inches section again i am closing this option offset command three inches approximately consider so copy the uh, point to the vertical direction section again in the same process just i am selecting the line just i am drawing here tr double enter so just we have to trim this uh, top section just we have to trim this uh, section again we have to trim this section just i am selecting this portion click on delete now you can see it was done with here again in the same process we have to create the ventilation section just i am selecting here as 9 inches section again i am selecting the line command again i am selecting here which is comes under the 9 inches section here okay approximately a enter option select this portion so again we have to extend the line so again i am selecting the line command extend this particular portion so tr double enter option trim this section which is comes under this category of left and right side okay so now we have to copy this offset command this time selecting here as three inches section copy this point again and copy this point okay this is the process of creating the ventilation now we have to copy the windows and ventilation for the vertical direction and horizontal direction so for that this time selecting this particular windows and ventilation section click on enter option just i am drawing to the respected right hand side okay so rotate this option to the 90 degrees so for that just i am selecting the rotate command select all this select the point option here and you can select here okay so now we have to draw the initially the reference lines so here i am selecting the line this is the reference line for the vertical uh, uh, window section adding so this is the reference line for adding the uh, ventilation section again in the same process i am assuming the window will be consisting of uh, uh, respected position and point here like this for this area okay in the same process i am selecting the line which is comes under this category again i am selecting the line reference line here like this okay now we have to draw the window section at this portion just i am drawing here like this okay so firstly we have to copy the window section for the specified area just i am selecting here just i am selecting here just i am selecting this point now we can see it was done with copying of the window in the same process i am selecting here it was done with copying of the window in the same process we have to copy this portion co enter option select this all click on enter select this point again i am selecting this particular area now you can see it was done with the window section now we have to create the ventilation so for that click on the copy command select these options click on enter select this point again we have to select this point in the same process we have to copy all the window sections as per the requirements window ventilation sections as per the requirements so now we can see here i was done with copying of the all the window sections for this area so just we have to remove the uh, reference line so which is uh, related to the vertical position as well as the horizontal position okay now we have to draw the staircases and uh, balcony positions for this area okay so for that just i am selecting the line command select this option six feet zero inches option okay again in the same process i am drawing the one more line which is comes under this category of six feet zero inches again i am selecting the vertical position now we have to connect these points like this this is the balcony position generally we will use now we have to draw the staircases select the offset just i am selecting the staircase slab will be comes under two feet again in the same process just i am assuming staircase will be comes under one feet zero inches section just i am drawing here like this selecting point again i am drawing here like this till the level of your respected position just i am drawing here like this again in the same process just i am drawing the line with the center point here like this okay now we can see here i was done with the drawing of uh, staircases here okay 
so the last step is to give the text for this uh, particular area okay so for that initially we need to measure the dimensions of all the room sections just i am selecting starting point select select the second point okay so again in the same process we have to measure the vertical dimensions of all the room sections here like this okay in the same process we have to measure all the room dimensions as per the consideration now we can see here i was measured with all the dimensions which is provided as per the architectural plan okay now we have to give the text for this bedroom so for that select the text command t enter select the starting point select the ending point so just i am giving the name is m bedroom let us consider m bedroom master bedroom so initially we need to enter the horizontal dimensions which is comes under 13 feet uh, 0 inches in the same process it will be consisting of 15 feet 0 inches vertical dimensions so here i am giving the text height is approximately 1 feet 0 inches on this top click on enter option click on this point now now we can see it was done with uh, master bedroom which is consisting of approximately 13 feet 15 inches in the same process we have to draw the text for all the rooms so now we can see here it was done with all the uh, dimensions assignment now we have to delete this uh, line assignment values click on delete option now we can see it was done with here and we have to draw the uh, white balcony section here like this again in the same process we have to draw the white balcony on the left, right hand side section for that just i am copying here select this option this and rotate that option just i am drawing here and rotating here move option m enter option select this select this particular position and click on the f8 option and we have to paste here like this okay so this is the process of giving the dimensions for that area now we have to draw the uh, dimension uh, door d and window w here for the respected section okay so for that initially we need to create the text on the right hand side section which is comes under the door section okay so just we have to give the notation approximately 9 inches again i am changing the layer to a color to red color here okay for the door okay again the same process we have to create the same section for the window also just i am drawing here like this for this area just i am renaming that name to window section sorry ventilation section again in the same process we have to create one more section which is comes under the window section with the w name okay now we have to copy the doors and window section as per the plan okay so click on the copy option select this door select the point just you have to paste here like this like this like this so now we have to copy the window section copy select this select the copy now in the same process we have to create the window section oh, sorry ventilation section copy option ventilation select here select this one select this point okay now you can see here it was done with copying ventilation this is the ventilation okay so now we have to measure the external dimensions for this plan okay now you can see here it will be consisting of approximately 15 feet here again it will be consisting of in the front facing side of approximately 17 feet here again it will be consisting of approximately the dimensions is uh, 11 feet 6 inches here again it will be consisting of the dimensions at the back side is 4 feet here okay so after drawing all the sections we need to take the print for this respected section so for the just i am selecting control z enter a enter option okay select the uh, plan as per your consideration of the layout section this is the layout section go to click on autocad click on the export option click on pdf option okay so now we have to select this option drawing number asd some file name just i am selecting here click on save option so that it will save the model then we have to able to see the output file which is uh, saved on the desktop which is comes under your respected name so now you can see this is the pdf which is consisting of all detailed concepts here like this okay so which is comes under this respected section okay so this is the complete process of how to draw the simple 2d floor plan house plan by using autocad uh, software from the rough diagram to real time project okay so if you have any queries about this respected video please try to text me your questions in the below comment box i will try to give the answer for the respected questions so in my autocad tutorials i was explained complete concepts up for different uh, uh, drawing of the floors and beam sections column sections by using autocad software you can watch that videos thank you